Hello and welcome to Really Random Rant, the short way to just that. I'm Tim. And I'm Al. And she is Vic. And today we are doing the Blender. Okay, so basically we took a bunch of different, well, basically Vic took a bunch of different things uh, that are all good. Uh, I think all of them are generally speaking good. Yeah. And then she put them in a blender and they might yeah. not be so good. Three in each. Uh, as you can see, they're numbered. She won't be in it much, uh, but we had to mention her name because she made these for us. And oh, she won't be in any of the videos coming out this week because yeah. she had, she spent a lot of time over there. All right. Anyway. So, uh, which, she will have to tell us the order though. Uh, this is one, so I go first with right. one. And we're gonna go every other yeah. one and then... And we, have to, we have to guess what the three ingredients are. Oh no. Now, I will say this. First of all... Oh, never mind, he doesn't like it. <laughs> you don't have to drink the whole thing, just a straw's ver- a straw- yeah, a straw's verse. Kind of straws first out. Is that garlic? Straw is Go, go. Um. Uh. Uh. Onion? That's what I'm thinking. Is it onion? Is there onion in it? Onion? Now, what are the other two? Water. <laughs> okay, onion. I don't know. All, all I taste is onion. Like, it, legitimately, everything I tasted, I, but, like, we get a point for each correct guess we get, and so, and so we have an opportunity for three points per round, so I'm just gonna go onion, pineapple, and crap, I don't know, was I, was I right? It's onion, cheese, and grapefruit juice. Oh, it sounds so bad. And now on to the guacamole. <laughs> it looks, okay, it just looks like guacamole. <laughs> I can honestly say I've never had guacamole on its own. <laughs> it, you know, if you guys look at this, it looks like guacamole. Like, to a T, color, consistency, it looks like guacamole. Refried beans. Nope. Oh. So whatever I she made. I felt so confident. So, too. Whatever she made <laughs> together makes the flavor <laughs> of refried beans. <laughs> um. So it's like goat soul. Tuna. 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 Yes. That's what you probably got for the consistency of the refried beans. The refried beans. Wait. How do you get the color of this out of tuna? Tuna is gray and disgusting. those those green hard. Bean things that are circles, they're like really tiny peas. No, not peas. Split well, peas. Split peas. Split, yeah. Well, it is peas. It's peas, okay. just normal peas. peas. Yes. That's what you can pick. The other thing is, um, since and you did three guesses. Um, oh, what were you guessing? But it's, he said, uh, oh, refried refri beans, beans, tuna. Is the other pickle? It's the something. other pickle relish. Oh. I would just you figured that. Would you would would you have given that to him if you if he had said pickle? If he had said pickle, I probably. That's because the real, essentially it's pickle. That's yeah. how I. Uh, that's how I guess the tuna. What? Because I I typically have tuna with pickle relish. Oh. Why do I get the ones that look like barf? <laughs> Like, look at this. It looks like frothy bark. <laughs> oh, by the way, if you want to make guacamole at a party and don't have avocados, <laughs> just take tuna, <laughs> tuna relish and peas. Yeah. <laughs> no one will know the difference. That's how you make refried peas. Was, that was it good? Uh, actually, on a scale, of, on, actually on a scale of one to ten, this, uh, as far as grossness goes, this is a ten. I put this as a three. A three? A three. So you just so want, you wouldn't want to eat it, but it wasn't bad. Exactly. This one's most of you. That's what you're supposed to think. But it's really bad. It's very watery. Oh, I got straight oh. That's strong pineapple. Pineapple. Pineapple is okay. on, yes. Pineapple. Pen and apple. Is this fruit? Is, is there just fruit in this? I can't tell you hints yeah. like that. 
peach? No peach. I got nothing. I just got pineapple. But it tastes like pineapple juice. Like, legitimately, like, if you were to take this and sip it, it would taste like pineapple juice. Which I'm, I'm, I'm a fan of. Like, it tastes like thick pineapple juice. So I'd say, I'd, I'd give it a, uh, a so, two. Because it, it has a strange consistency. But other than that, it was absolutely fine. So it's pineapple? Whoa, 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 whoa. What, what was it? Pineapples, applesauce, and orange juice. I got the apple. I can taste the applesauce. Like so. Um, on to a new hope. Drink number four. It, it, it looks like a frothy grape. It looks like frothy grape juice slash a sponge. It looks like a sponge that like lives in an ocean of. Oh, grape never mind the aftertaste. First <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, this is amazing. And then, and then it's, oh, it's not. <laughs> Bad. It's just not. It, it's <laughs> it not changes, as good as no, what you it thought. It changes like. from sweet to something else at the end. Right. <laughs> That's a relationship for you. It goes from <laughs> sweet to <laughs> something else. <laughs> <laughs> like you got, you got, well, the, you you got the initial though? taste of sweetness, and then you have the aftertaste of something else. It's not that great. <laughs> Grape juice. Yes, grape juice. What? Where would you get the idea of a grape juice? A grape juice? <laughs> you squeeze the one grape. <laughs> pineapple? Yes, pineapple. Well, grape was now, so Now what would be giving it that aftertaste? Milk. <laughs> it's, it's just curdling in there. It's turning into like a frothy monstrosity. I have no idea what no, 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 like, what I'm thinking is like milk and so you got something? No. What's the aftertaste taste like? Hard to describe. <gasps> Wait! Grapefruit juice. Yes! Oh, oh that's what like it is. Grapefruit juice. As soon as as soon as you're like, what's the aftertaste? I mean, it's hard to describe, like throw up and then I'm like, it's grapefruit juice. Okay, so on a scale of one to ten on the really random gross out scale. I would say a five or a six. Really, it's just, it's just the aftertaste. aftertaste. And if you're if you like grapefruit juice, there's going to be no problem. Oh my word! Number this... five. Okay, tell me this doesn't look like hot sauce mixed with um uh, feta cheese. That's chili for you. It, no, it looks like hot sauce mixed with feta cheese. No, all she did was she took chili and went, <laughs> but she took out the beans and stuff. Yep, I, I hand picked out all the Really? Beans, More onions? <laughs> okay, onion. I can smell look, the onion. Yeah, look, I still have this coming up. I had the good that ones. That looks like paste. I had, <laughs> looks I like had paste. the good ones, and then I got this. <laughs> it looks like, like toothpaste mixed with mustard. <laughs> Does it? That's the perfect way to describe that color. Toothpaste and mustard. <laughs> and then the aftertaste is going to come up and it's just going to mix together and you're going to be like oh. Are you going to try? Something? No, I don't no. think so. So I was right on onion? Yeah, but you had to try. <laughs> That's unholy. Oh. That tastes... It Okay, I, right I, I say <laughs> this sometimes. I say this sometimes. But this tastes like Shane feels. Like, oh my goodness. Okay, so, um. Okay. Water and onions. That's what it tastes like. <laughs> I don't, what is it? It's not. It's onions, spaghetti sauce, and Parmesan cheese. That's why it looks like hot sauce and, uh. Yeah. The onions, spaghetti the, sauce. The onions and Parmesan cheese are what made it look like, uh. All right. So basically, oh, it's, it's everything you put on spaghetti minus the meatball. And the onions? <laughs> Who puts onions on spaghetti? So it's mixed in with the sauce usually. Yeah. Uh, okay. Oh, well, okay. So 